there, Jen and Casey here with another Fusion video. Today we're going to be talking about a little bit about beginner basics. So fingertip abdominals, this is a wonderful way to start to teach and explain how we want our client's abdominal wall to fire, especially their transverse abdominals, which is so important. We really need our clients and even ourselves to fully understand all of the ways that our abdominal wall works but also releases. So I'm gonna give Jen a little bit of an inner thigh, kind of spacer, and what you wanna do is when you give your clients this spacer, you don't want them to squeeze the life out of it, but what happens if they push too hard on this is that, as you can see, Jen's glutes mm -hmm. grip, and if there's a crowding around the pubic bone, and it makes it really difficult for her to find her neutral pelvis. So what you wanna see is, you want this tailbone to be nice and heavy, for her to gently let the sitting bones go wide and to the side, beautiful. And as you see, I gave Jen a little bit of a pillow so that she can feel the back of her solar plexus be nice and heavy into the mat. Now, Jen, I want you to take a nice long inhale that rides the spine and a slow, deep exhale to just feel your body melting into the mat. So it's really important to have your clients key down a little bit when they go into this more subtle contraction of the abdominal wall. Now what I'm going to do with my hands here is I'm going to find her ASIS and go just inside of it. Now Jen, I want you to take a nice inhale and on this exhale, I want you to see if you can sink my fingertips down towards the mat without changing your pelvis. Very good. And Jen has a very highly trained transverse contraction. So sometimes on your clients that don't know what you're talking about, you're going to have to give them a little bit of a direction to go with. So we're going to use, as MJ says, our mentor, Marie Jose, any Audi uppy. So Jen, on the next exhale, I want you to pull my fingertips in. I want you to spread them out and draw it up. So take an inhale here. And then exhale in with my fingertips. Mm -hmm. Out with my fingertips. Ooh, very nice. And now can you draw it up, keeping your neutral pelvis beautiful and release. Inhale here. Exhale, and I'm pressing in. I'm helping her draw out, pulling on the tissue, and then also tractioning up. Last time, inhale, exhale, in. I'm pulling out towards her hip bones, and I'm tractioning up. Beautiful. Now, to add on to this, if you want to do a little bit more of a challenge, because you can feel underneath your fingertips that your client has these basics, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold on to this ball. So Jen, let's have you find your beautiful any outy uppy on an exhale. So any outy, very good, and uppy. Now I want you to inhale, hold it, and then on the exhale, I'm going to traction the ball out as she feels like she's drawing the conveyor belt of the inner thighs up that fingertip abdominal contraction. Inhale one more time. Exhale, feel like you're drawing this macosa ball into the pelvis and that uppy is bringing it up towards the wide collarbones. And release, very good. So this is a really great way to be very direct and very specific of how you want your clients to contract their abdominals. Thank you so much for joining us and we'll see you soon.